good day and welcome to my channel once again this is your boy Tolex image in this video we are going to be talking about how to achieve a sharp ear line if you look at the image before you this is me and I look so rough in it I look shabby what if you have a client that came in exactly the same way like this to take some shots how would you have you know presented his uh, photographs to him at the end of the day you can do better than this this is the after of this photograph you are looking at before you this looks beautiful right okay so before we go on to achieve this if you are yet to subscribe to this channel please kindly do so and help subscribe to this channel like and hit the notification button as well so that when we drop new videos you'll be notified the only way you can help this channel grow is to subscribe because at the end of the day it's going to motivate us we are really trying to do our best to impact others okay so let's venture into what we have today so let me turn off this layer okay so I'll be making use of my I'll be making use of my pen tool here. This is my pen tool. Right click and find pen tool. Okay. So this is the edge of my hair starting from here. Okay. Okay, so let me do it this way. Okay. Control Z. No. If you look at my ear, even the stylist has done some bad justice to it. It's, it's too deep in here. So these are some of the advantages of these um, skills. Knowing about this, when the ear is too deep this way. Okay. Okay, let me. Okay, now having done it this way, hold down the odds button okay okay i want to stop here let me stop it here and it's here for now okay so let me come and do this other side here as a man we usually know when stylists are doing it where your shapes are being coughed from so let me say it's something around here okay so Okay, so alt as well to come down a little bit. Okay, so I think I think I'm okay like this. Okay, it's okay like this. Yeah, like so. I'm going to be dropping this now. You drop the mouse first before the alt. Okay. So I haven't done that. Come here again to this edge and drag this a little bit forward. Okay. Okay, so I have to come here to somewhere around here and then somewhere around here. Okay, let me make that edge like this. Okay, let me make something like this. Okay, and then um, hold down the Alt button as well. Okay, like this, like so. Do it this way. Hold down the Alt button and do it this way, and drop the mouse first for you. Okay, the same thing you want to just come forward a little bit okay if you look at it i don't really have a teddy around my hair cheek so let me go back okay so like so okay this way this way i think i'm good to go i think i love it this way let me just uh, do this do this, do this, do this, this way, you know, 
so you get to your starting point again okay so i haven't done it this way the next thing i want to do is to come to my create a new layer here to create a new layer here okay let me control z the new layer is supposed to be okay create a new layer here and um, the next thing i want to do is to come and um, come to your paint tool should in case you have any adjustments come to your coverture paint tool if you have any adjustment to this you can just easily do that you know now control z okay i think the only adjustment i want to make to this is just to come here okay so it's just to come here like this and um, i think i'm good to go i think i love what i have Okay, coming back to this part of the hair, I have to come and reduce my the level of my flow to like five. Okay, as you can see, it's like six. Okay, so let me make it of six. So the next thing I want to do is come down here again and then just fill this area because this the shape the air cut i actually add here this side do not need to be as full as the top of the hair but they still need to look they still need to look very beautiful and attractive so okay so look for spaces in between the hair and just fill it up okay so you can see we are good to go now we are good to go come to this side of the hair as well Just do the same thing here. Yeah. So, having done this, now if you look at this, this is the before. This is the before and the after of this image. We've been able to fill all these areas up. So, the next thing we are going to do is if you look at this edge, the outer part of this uh the edge here is still look rough so what we are going to do is come to your rectangular marker tool 
right click and select inverse so this select inverse will make we enable us to work on the facial part on this other side so come to your clone stamp as usual and I'll still continue on everything you see here maintain the same settings and um, just now what you need to do is alt as usual on any part of the skin and just do this do this you know okay let me zoom in so that you can see what is being done on the long run okay let me okay so you can see what we are achieving this beautiful results let me reduce the size of my brush it's kind of disturbing so so can you see as you can see as you can see we've been able to clean that area and get a very sharp edge around our hair let me come to this side in case we have any parts that we are not seeing clearly okay so this way just try to brush these areas and um, ensure you have a very clean skin around here at the end of the day it will come out beautifully that even your clients will be wondering i do not look as good as this when i came to your studio so you understand so lest i forget if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet kindly do that so around this place i just have to you know do a little bit of cleaning around my hair so that it will also look neat okay so i think i'm good to go i love it the way it is now let me come down here as well and then just just a little bit of cleaning you know okay i think i'm good to go this way if you look at our before and after you will really see that we have done good justice to this image let me control d to deselect so before okay no sorry before after before after so you can see that we have that sharp air cuts around that area now so if at all this video has been helpful to you kindly subscribe like and hit the notification button to help this channel grow thanks so much for watching and do have a blessed day ahead of you bye